everyone, it's Ray. Today I'm gonna be sharing with you what is in my bag. I love this type of video. I just think it's so interesting to see what people carry in their bags. So if you are also one of those people that just loves seeing what's in people's bags, you have found the video for you. So this is my bag. It is a Longchamp Le Pelage tote. I've had this one for quite some time. It's held up pretty well. Um, it is a nylon material with the leather detailing. And of course I have my monogrammed because of course I have it monogrammed, monogram queen. So let's just see what is inside of it. And I have not cleaned my bag out beforehand or anything. So I really don't know what we're gonna get. I tend to keep things pretty neat and organized though. The first thing I have in my bag is a little mini hairbrush. My hair tends to get tangled pretty easily, so I like to keep a brush on me. The next thing I have is my little card carrier. I actually got this one at Kohl's. It was on sale. I had a coupon for like $10 off, so this thing was super cheap. It was like $2 and something. But I was looking for one that had a ton of different little slots for my cards. There's debit card, Target card, Hobby Lobby gift card I always forget about, Kroger card, Ulta rewards card, Panera rewards card. The Ulta program is the best thing in the world. I love the rewards points so much. I definitely take advantage of that. And then let's see, I have some more rewards cards like for Petco for my dog Prudence. And Kohl's, which I don't really shop at very often, but if I have a coupon, I will hit that up. And I have one for Saks Off Fifth, which is in a mall pretty close to me. Uh, my insurance card, an old New York and Company card, and just other random cards. Inside of this guy in this little zipper pocket is where I keep my cash if I have any cash on me. So this little pocket is normally where my license would be, but I pulled it out for the video just now. And then I have this extra little pocket right here, which is where I keep business cards. I have my husband's business cards for his office. And then I have my business card for the organizing business that I do on the side. Next, I have a Warby Parker glasses case and my glasses are inside. My case is a little beat up because it's been living in my purse for a long time. And then I have my glasses. I really love the Warby Parker program where you could try on the glasses at home. Just a little side note, yay Warby Parker. Then I have a floral glasses case. Um, this holds my Ray-Bans. I used to have a Ray-Bans case, but it broke pretty quickly. So I just have these guys in there. Next I have this little Clinique pouch. Um, this is what I keep my beauty products in. The first thing I have in there is a Merle Norman Ultra Powder Foundation Compact for touch-ups throughout the day. Next I have some NYX Green Tea Blotting Papers. Whenever you have oily skin, these are a must and my skin gets super oily, so can't live without that. I have some Revlon Tweezers. Um, these I keep with me because I feel like the best time to pluck your eyebrows is when you're in natural light. So when I'm in the car and I notice something, I like to have tweezers with me. I have the Bare Minerals Marvelous Moxie Lip Gloss in there in the color Rebel. Um, I talked about this in my January Favorites video. I am wearing it all the time. Then I have two NYX products. This one is a NYX Butter Lipstick in the color Snowcap and a NYX Butter Gloss in the color Fortune Cookie. I like layering both of these products together and it just creates a nice nude lift that goes with, you know, a heavier eyeshadow look. Also in my little beauty bag, I have a Skinny & Co Lip Balm. It is a peppermint flavor and it's all natural beeswax with coconut oil and essential oils. I haven't really made a dent in it yet. It smells really good though. The last thing in my little beauty bag is a Boing concealer from Benefit. I love this concealer. Um, I just carry it with me if I need any touch-ups. So that's everything in my beauty bag. Going back into my purse. This is another little cosmetic bag from Clinique. And this one just holds my feminine products. Next, I have a little travel Kleenex pouch. I like to always have these on me. I only have one left in here and having some cold, y'all. 
I love this style of the little travel Kleenexes because it's so skinny, it doesn't take up a lot of room in my bag. I have a little travel size of the Big Sexy Hair Get Layered Hairspray. Next I have some Altoids, don't want to have stinky breath. This little guy might be my favorite thing in my purse. It is one of the purse hooks that you can use on like a table when you're out somewhere. This will just hold your purse and it balances with this little weight right here. Um, my mom gave me this one, but I have seen them at Charming Charlie's before. I love these because it keeps your purse from getting knocked around if it's on the back of your chair. And if you are out somewhere and you want to keep an eye on your purse, it kind of lets it be directly in front of you or beside you. I have an umbrella. This one is from Target. I have the room in my bag to keep this, so I pretty much always do. I forget to check the weather and it's just easier for me to always have an umbrella on me. I have this pouch. I have no idea where this came from, but it's really skinny and I keep all my papers that are flying around in my purse and coupons inside of here. So inside of this pouch, I have some Kroger coupons, an Ulta receipt, some Victoria's Secret coupons, more Kroger coupons, even more Kroger coupons. I swear I don't even go to Kroger that much, y'all. It's nice to have a coupon when you do. All the Kroger coupons in the world have made their way into my purse, apparently. I have a couple of drink tokens. So this one is for Three Crow Bar, and this one is for Beyond the Edge. Both of these are places in East Nashville that I really enjoy. An admit to free ticket for the Big Bang Piano Bar here in Nashville. I love that place too. Sopapilla's Mexican Restaurant, a complimentary chili con queso or tamale bites. I have some Target coupons and that's it for this guy. I have a koozie in my purse. I don't like to be caught without a koozie. My friend gave me this one. It's for White Squirrel Brewery in Bowling Green, Kentucky. And I haven't been there, but I love squirrels so much and my friend knows that, so thank you. And at the very bottom of my bag, the last thing I have is some trash because it is not a purse if it's not being used at least a little bit as a trash can. So that's everything that was in my bag today. These bags can hold an awful lot. I do recommend them. The only downside to them is that it is pretty much one big open compartment, but if you use little bags to organize inside like I did, that doesn't really bother me any at all. Thanks for watching guys. Please click subscribe if you enjoyed this video. I'm gonna to try to put out a new video every week and you can stay up to date on what's happening here on my channel.